Hello all, Randy Rogers, Mortgage Loan Originator here. I hope everyone is doing great and enjoyed a wonderful and restful weekend. Today, I wanted to explain the term mattress money and explain how it affects a mortgage application. Putting it simply, mattress money is money that you keep outside of a financial institution. It doesn't literally have to be under your Tempur-Pedic. It's just not in a bank or savings and loan or other financial organization. Maybe you work a job such as a restaurant server, house cleaner, home handyman, and deal in a large number of cash transactions, but you keep those in a safe place at home rather than in a checking account. This is mattress money. The challenge you'll encounter is that very few lenders or title companies will accept cash for closing. If you wanna use the thousands in your empty coffee cans or buried in the backyard to purchase a home, plan ahead. Deposit funds you'll use at least 60 days before starting your application process. These funds need to be documented and traceable. There are federal laws in place that require banks to evaluate and report certain large deposits. The purpose of these laws is to protect against money laundering and identify potentially illegal activities. Such deposits have to be seasoned, meaning they must be in an account for enough time to verify their legitimacy. If a buyer deposits an unusually large sum in the bank a week before closing, these funds won't be usable for a down payment or closing costs, which can delay a closing. As another benefit, you might even earn a few bucks in interest. Alternately, consider using these funds to pay off debts and reduce your debt to income ratios in preparation for buying at home. As always, if you are purchasing a home in the great state of Texas, I would be honored to be your lender. Please contact me or apply today through my website, trinityoaksmortgage.com slash R-R-O-D-G-E-R-S. Have a blessed day.